Hello guys and welcome to another tutorial and today I'm going to show you how to sum a column in your Notion application or Notion website. So the first thing that I want you to do now is to open your Notion desktop application or you can just connect to your Notion website with your Google account or with your email. After that, all you need to do is to uh, follow these simple steps. So the first thing that I'm doing here in this example is to create a database because uh, the Calculate, uh, calculated uh, cells are just in the databases. So basically I'm going just to have this empty page and here in my page, I'm going to insert a database. I'm going just to use an inline database. So I have just a small one. So here you are seeing like that I have like a text. Uh, as you can see, this is a text column. This is a selection or text column and now I'm going to add like numbers so we can calculate the sum of this column so I'm going to click here let's just have uh, nums and uh, search for number and the property name will be for example num and now I'm going to insert the property and now you can see it displayed in my database so I'm going to add some number like for example one two three just have 420 or whatever and now to have like the calculated uh, cells if you click new you won't find it so all you need to do is to go below new option uh, let's just delete this one delete this so here we have the new option to add a record and below we have the calculatable uh, records or columns so basically i'm going to click on calculate and here i will have uh, some different type of operation that i can do either it will count the items or you can have like a percentage of something average median minimum or maximum and the range of uh, this column but we want to have like the sum so all i need to do is to click on sum and as you guessed it will calculate automatically the sum of my column and as you can see the sum of these numbers is 543 so basically this is how you sum your columns in a notion application or notion website thank you for watching and see you next time